Come on, Oliver. It's your turn. You got me. Stalemate. Mum and Dad should be here soon. They'll be so proud when they see your improvement. How about you draw them a picture? Here, let me help you. What would I do without Oliver? You know, I love the way my family is. I've always thought my parents were the most beautiful, with my dad's strong cheekbones and jawline, and my mum's feminine eyes and perfectly symmetrical nose. They look exactly how I'd want them to. I can't imagine having anyone else. And my brother Oliver. He definitely takes from my mother, more than I do at least. He's bright, creative, I don't doubt that he'll be successful in life. I'm a bit more like my dad. I don't talk to people much, but there's a certain comfort in being alone, cheering everyone else on from the sidelines. Yes, Mum, we're fine. Oliver had his first day of school today, and I think he's doing really well. I pity those who aren't close with their family. I mean, I can't imagine anything worse than growing up without the love of your parents and siblings. Having people there for you, who will support you even if you've done the worst thing in the world. That's something I really cherish. I can't remember much from when I was a kid. I think I was kind of weird and I blocked out most of my memory before my baby brother was born. When Oliver came along, my whole world changed. The biggest responsibility in my life is to take care of him, no matter what. I wish I could just protect him from all the evil in this world, but I'll, I'll let him figure it out on his own. Oh, I think Mum and Dad are home. Come on, Oliver. Hey, Dad. Look what Oliver drew. Pretty good, isn't it? What do you think, Mum? Since the accident, why is it you feel you're always in stalemate? Well, being stuck in a stalemate is not so bad when you've got a family like mine. I think it's time for me to pick Oliver up from school now.